Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This short video is a little bonus added to my two main Thanksgiving videos. Not a long time ago I was invited to stay over at a friend's house and I decided to create a little gratitude full inspired gift basket for her to thank her for her generosity. I thought I would bring you with me during this adventure. I only had an afternoon to plan and create this gift and I thought it would be inspiring and interesting for you to know how to create a nice gift in a short amount of time. So if this is something that you want to see, just keep watching. What I did with this basket is that I gave it a theme and a purpose. My theme is full, obviously, and my purpose is to bring her things that she's actually going to use or eat. So she asked me to bring some snacks and I made a selection of gluten-free snacks, of course. Here I have Amaran bar, vegetable chips, quince fruit paste and apples. And I also added a cinnamon apple tea and an apple cider. This is for the food part. Now for the object part, I added some kitchen items like food towels and a spice dispenser. This is because she's very interested in, in learning more about cooking and I am going to show her just that. Her passion is gardening, so I thought it would be nice to add some special items for her gardening projects. And instead of buying a regular gift basket, I decided to create a whole gift around a planter. So she's definitely going to be able to reuse this later. I also found a tiny mini planter that I will add to the basket and to finish I added some home decor items that I thought would be useful for her as props for her pictures and videos on social media. To wrap my basket I usually use thermosensitive plastic wraps. I sometimes shrink it with a blow dryer, sometimes I leave it like that because it looks more appropriate to the concept. Uh, I also add a nice ribbon on the top. I always pick a color palette from my gift boxes and it's always a fun part to find some items that actually match the theme. You never know, you could get inspired by an object that matches your color palette and create a whole new concept around it. This is a very fun part. In the bottom of my basket, I ended up ditching the paper for some craft paper back from the grocery store. A great way to recycle and it looks so good and very full. I started to place all the objects in the basket, the bigger one first and the small ones at the end. The thing is that with the basket, it's you never know how this is going to end up. I had an idea and I realized I couldn't do it, so I tried to move things around until everything fit nicely. I wrapped my gift basket in this thermosensitive plastic wrap and ended up with this beautiful fall color ribbon on the top. I also had an idea for the top of the basket and actually didn't work so I ended up putting the mini planter with a piece of pine branch and putting a note inside the planter. I always put a note, it's also my way to make people feel extra special. This is of course Totally hygge, a concept of coziness and conviviality, pleasure and time. I hope you liked this video and it will inspire you to create a special gift for the people you love. Plus, Christmas is coming. Hello! Don't forget to click on the like button and leave comments. It means so much to me. I wish you a wonderful rest of your day and I see you next week. Bye! Oh